How's it going guys? I'm the Gons, and this is my LP of Super Mario Brothers 2. The Revenge of Mario Madness. No, it's not the Revenge. But it is Mario Madness. And it's uh Mario's back. Bigger and better than ever before. Yep. Um Bad News. I've already played through it. This is uh my second intro that I'm recording. Um, and my audio was bad. Uh, it came back too low, so I have decided to dub over my gameplay because, <laughs> well, I had two choices. Either I play it again uh, with proper audio settings or I redo my commentary. I have decided to redo my commentary. Uh... I could play through it again because I totally owned it. I owned Mario Brothers 2. Totally owned it. And you'll see what I mean. The part of the the reason why I did so well because of the, is because of the first first level. I got really really lucky with the uh, the bonus game. And you'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean. So yeah, that's basically my uh, my heads up, I guess. My commentary isn't live, which sucks because I had some pretty good commentary. Um, I had a m lot of memories resurface, which helped me in the game to really speed it up. Um, I, f I got two warps, and it, you know I'm not gonna even spoil it. Let's let's just let's just get into it. I owned Mario two. That's pretty much it. <laughs> so, here we go. Super Mario Bros. 2. Hope you like it. And, um, sorry, it's not live commentary. Alright, here we go. Released in 1988. Wow. Um, I didn't mention this in the new end. Oh, wait, here we go. Got story. When Mario opened a door after climbing a long stair in his dream, another world spread before him and he heard a... Apparently heard a voice. And after awakening, Mario went to a cave nearby. <laughs> and to his surprise, he saw exactly what he saw in his dream. The star button. Alright. So... <clears throat> usually I pick Toad. That's kind of why I hovered over Toad. But, uh, Luigi's the man. After uh, playtesting a little bit, uh, I found Luigi just rocked Super Mario Brothers 2, so I'm picking him. Um, and like I was saying in the intro, I didn't mention that uh, this is actually a remake, a a reskin of uh, of another game. <clears throat> I'm not sure if that's uh, how you would say it, but. Anyway, this actually started as Dream Factory Heart Pounding Panic. <laughs> That's the uh, the translated uh, Japanese title. And uh, the reason why Nintendo of America said, no, 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 make us a new one, is because the, uh, the actual sequel uh, was too similar and too hard. To the first, uh, compared to the first one, so they're like, no, 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 give us another one. And they're like, well, this one will never make it to the U.S. Here, here, it just change the sprites, and there you go. Oh, you see how he uh, went out and then went back in. I was gonna go just finish the game, but the thing is, there's no continues in this game, except the ones that you're given. There's only two continues. So you run out of lives, you get to continue, you run out of lives again, you get to continue. After that, that's it. So the key is to get as many coins as you can in each stage to um, play the bonus game at the end of each stage. So that's why I went back to get all those coins. Look, look at that, first shot, yep. Get in there, Luigi. You're the man. The, uh, you're the man that can't go up, there you go, can't go up the ladder. This is a this is just a shortcut to the boss. 
it's not a warp or anything. But, uh, oh, you miss, I missed the egg there. Um, but yeah, I remember a lot of little stuff like this. The, um, the war, oh man, I missed again. I think I was nervous. <laughs> and I was trying to remember this bird's name. It's not Birdo. I oh, I got the, uh, I got the manual here since my hands are free. It's, it's kind of, kind of cool actually. Oh, and I went to get the heart and I missed it. Fail. So here we go, nine coins. There's a bonus chance. Oh, I didn't get anything there. Uh, mm, nothing. Let's do it again. You gotta time it. T oh yeah, five up. Five lives for three cherries. Awesome. Still got five coins. Go in the distance. There we go. One up. Not too bad. Was that six lives? It's not bad at all. And I still have coins. Let's see. It's. Nope. Nope. Can I get another one? Nope. Last chance. Oh no, this is this is my last chance. <laughs> no, that's it. Alright, whatever. And I think I stay with Luigi. Ostro. That's a bird thing's name. Ostro. Okay. Um, in case you didn't know, each of the uh, characters that you can pick, uh, they're not all the same. Luigi kind of has a very floaty jump compared to the other to the other guys, and I think he can also jump the highest if you charge your jump. There we go. Coins first, then the mushroom. Yeah, his charge jump can jump the highest, and I'll demonstrate that right here. Bam, right there. All you gotta do is hold down and jump once you start glowing. Yo, more coins! Oh yeah, more coins. <laughs> I'm greedy. Loads of coins. Uh, Toad can uh, pick stuff up the fastest. So if I was Toad right there, I would have been able to get that last coin. Alright, Ostro. I don't know why... Why do I uh, think of you as Birdo? I'm trying to remember. Can't remember. You would think uh, it would develop some kind of defense mechanism against its own eggs. But <laughs> apparently not. So, get, get in there for... Yeah! Crouch in there. Nine coins again. Look at that, starting out with a one-up. Hmm. It'd be kind of cool if I could get another five-up. But no, I don't... I don't I'm not going to get another five-up. It's just one-ups from here on out. Gotta get a few. If you uh, start off with a cherry, it doesn't matter what you get in the second box. You'll always get a one-up. Three cherries is five. I think three stars is three. Um, getting them all the same, I think, is a one-up. It's pretty generous, but um, in my practice file, holy cow. I couldn't get one. I was stuck with three lives the whole time. Yeah, get in there, Luigi. You're the man. For these first couple stages, anyway. Look at that jump. Just floats across the air. Look at that head. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I think I try to do something fancy here. I think I carry this bottle, even though I didn't have to. It's like, oh man, coins, coins. All right, yeah. I just, I just need to jump up there. I missed it. Oh. Damn it! Apparently, if you do a uh, a super jump while you have while you're holding something, you'll throw whatever it is that you're holding. It's not bad. I got the mushroom and uh, 
some coins. And here's the first warp. You find that bottle, and you carry it all the way over here. And you jump down that pot. That's your first warp. World 4, too. So we just warped, what, two, two worlds? And I think it's a snow one. Yep, that's why I switched to Princess. So you're slipping and sliding. Worse than Super Mario 1. If you can believe that. I'm like, oh, that, that, that looks suspicious, yep. There's a bottle there. Get me some coins. Can she get the last one? Yes, yeah, she can. I think her picking a bit. Oh, that's cheap. I forgot about that. Freaking cheap. But I think the princess can, um, is the second fastest to picking stuff up. I knew there was much from there. Yeah, she's pretty quick at picking stuff. That, oh, man. I almost fell. <laughs> I have a pause there, like, fuck. And I thought this was like, um, I thought this was pretty weird. Because it's the boss, it's the boss music, but, um, there's no Ostro. There's no bird. It's kind of weird. Oh, yeah, in case you haven't noticed, uh, the princess's ability. <laughs> ability to float uh, when she does a jump. Pretty cool. Man, nine coins again. I don't think I get as lucky in this one, though. I may be... I may get one... one up. Yeah. Get th there, there's one. Oh, I, I think I get another one. Come on. Nope. Come on, 14's not enough. There we go. <clears throat> Maybe another one? No. Last coin. Close. I think I stay with the princess here. These ice levels are a bitch. Oh, remember this. Get over that guy. There we go. No problem. And there's a mushroom back there. Um. But uh, I'm not getting it. <laughs> it's, a re it's a mushroom right on the whale's tail. So good luck making that jump. I've died. Oh man, I've died so so many times trying to get that mushroom. And here's the second warp. And apparently that's all the warps you need, or that you can get. Back to Luigi. Sand levels. I think the reason why I picked Luigi is because um, there's a stage or uh, a, a secret that only Luigi can reach. I was like, surely it's in this one. But I don't think it is. I think it just... I think it's later on. In fact, I don't think I even get it. And it's not a warp. Um, it's uh, just like a shortcut. Kind of like on the, the first world. Oh, man. Look at that guy. Just see him struggling. It's like, oh, no. <laughs> Suffocating in the sands. I was like, one up? Oh, it's just a show. Maybe in this one. Shy guy, get out of the way. Nope. No one-ups, 
just a shell. I don't even know what to do with it. Cactus. They're they're called pokey. <laughs> Very original. And I always remember writing this guy, and I was like, why why did I always jump on this guy? Oh, this is why. To get over that thing. Even though you could just throw a a vegetable at it. Or uh you can grab the head of the uh, cactus and throw it at it, but... Whatever. See, this is where I thought it was a jump. Because you could jump on there, but it doesn't lead anywhere. And I remember here, I always remember two snakes. First snake, second snake, ow. And then the pot. There it is. This is the right one. Yeah, it's the right one. Amazing that uh, I can remember little details about a game I played <laughs> over 15 years ago, but I forget like what what uh what day my birthday's on. If you can believe that. Come on, Luigi, get up there. So weird is this game, man. I and mean, you could tell it's just not an original Mario game. It's so weird. But it's kind of cool how the uh, these Birdos, I, I keep calling them Birdos, these Ostros, they kind of come back, as, as well as the Shy Guys. That was cheap. Doesn't matter though. I'm taking the brick, bl the, the the brick. No, I'm not. Do I get an extra life here? I don't think I do. Close. And the timings, it, it's just one second apart. Apparently. Doesn't work though. Not always. Really, it's just blind luck. I think I was thinking, oh, man, where's that jump? Where's that jump? Because I remember, I also remember a a bit with a bunch of birds. I was like, oh man, I don't want Luigi there. I want the princess. I want the princess. I was like, oh man, oh, what do I? What do I do? Oh, I'll go with Luigi. He's been owning these stages so far, so. Might as well. And here's the bird part. <laughs> Let's see if I can make th make it through with one life. Pumpkins. Why? Notice that. Oh. Oh, I know why. Pause it. Um. I wanted to hold down the run button. Just so I could get a bigger jump, but I was scared of uh, put oh, duck that. <laughs> I was scared I'd pick up the bird if I hit the run button, so I paused it, held down the run button, and then unpaused it, and uh, that way I didn't risk it. But notice the starry sky; it's actually stars. I think that uh, that carries through to the rest of the Super Mario games. I'm tired of you, Ostro, with your puke green color. And I thought, oh man, this guy's easy. I don't even have to wait for the eggs. Just gotta get the timing right. Here. Oh man, I missed it. Missed. Oh, what was that? It's cheap. Oh well, one more hit. They only take three. Here we go. Here we go. Just gotta wait. Gotta wait. Here we go. <laughs> and the little shrieks they make. 
Get in there, Luigi, with style. Hop in. <laughs> and no coins. I don't think I get a coin ever from here on out. And I was like, oh man, what do I do with this? It's gotta be right here. Nope. So I thought, uh, let's reset it. There's gotta be something. And I was like, why is there sand on the left? Who's gonna fall for that? <laughs> Who's gonna go over there and drown? So come here. Oh, it's gotta be here. Maybe. I was like, no. There's gotta be a reason for this. There's gotta be a reason. Maybe you take the bottle over here. I was like, uh... Yep. Sure enough. Heart-pounding panic. <laughs> Got a little bit nervous here, I think. And this is uh, another shortcut. See, that's where you would have uh, ended up if you went the proper way. But we don't do things proper around here. We get right in there. Red Ostro. Getting tired of you guys. Aw, oh, what was that? No problem. No problem. Oh, good defense. Good defense. Still, no problem. Look at that. Oh, that was a mistake. That's that's my, my mistake. Just gotta wait for the timing. There, oh! Something about... Oh, did you see that? I was ducking. And it still gets you. It's cheap. It's alright, though. Got 14 lives. <laughs> There's no way I'm gonna go through 14 lives on this guy, right? Gotta wait for the timing. Gotta wait for the timing! Oh, I can't believe that! That's the problem with Luigi. His pickup time is crap. Probably because he stays floating in the air for so long. No problem, no problem. Can't wait for the timing. There's a heart there. I was like, oh man, I, I could do this. I can get it. Uh, uh, shit. Missed the block. What is that? It's not, it's not a block. It looks like a mushroom, but not really. Yeah. That was unfortunate. Don't don't pick it up. Just jump. Go. Oh. How does that happen? I was like, no way. <laughs> no way. No way this guy just took 3 lives from me. No way. Ah. Oh, bastard. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, traded hits, no problem. Fire. Fire burns! I'm pretty sure if that hole wasn't there, I would have died. Let's go. One more. I'm getting scared here. <laughs> Come on, Luigi. Come on, Luigi. Go. Oh man, risking it there. Get in there. <laughs> it's not over! Oh man. I remember this boss though. All you gotta do is stand down here, super jump, and then throw the block. You just gotta get the timing right. Ugh. And he's a sneaky bastard. Watch. He'll throw a couple, and then he'll throw one late like that! Cheap as hell. So that's... What? Five loss? Lives lost to uh, this stage? 
eat that. <laughs> Watch the timing. What? Yeah, oh, there's that... The straggler. What's this guy's name? Triclide. Triclide. <laughs> alright. No extra life. No, no, no bonus. It's alright, though. I think by now, I was like, alright, that secret jump, that easy jump, I probably missed it. So, let's go with a uh, princess. Princess is pretty, uh, reliable. And I remember here, I was like, wait a minute, why well, have a bird there? I was like, yeah, you just jump on it, you just jump on it. You, 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 you just jump on it. <laughs> Nothing special here. Just, uh, another way to get up here. In fact, I think that's how you were supposed to do it. If you went to the other side, it's probably a dead end. Because this seems very, uh, proper. And here's that jump where if I had Luigi, it would have helped out. See, I'm trying to make it there. You can jump over that brick. I was like, fuck, come on, man. Come on! Nope. Princess can make it. It's not that bad, though. It's just a little bit... A little bit of turning here, a little bit of turning there. There you go. It's not a, it's not a big issue. And those pellets, even though they've hit the wall, they're, they're still active. They'll still hit you. Nothing. Oh, what happened there? Easy, easy. <laughs> Come on, princess. You and me. Now this is, this is another jump. If I had Luigi, he could have made. Oh, come on! At least I took him with a, took him with me. If I had Luigi, he could have made that jump. Luigi's a man. Let's see, how are we gonna do this? Timing is key. Kill that guy. Oh. Mm. Get out of here. <laughs> They're giant heads. A little bit tricky here. But no big deal. Just gotta time it. Shy guy. That's actually not a shy guy, that's uh Something spit? Sniff it! They're called sniffits. <laughs> what was that? I think I'm scared here. It's like shit, it's all fire. <laughs> Don't pick it up. Oh, what did I say? I miscounted. The rotation is three. Shoot three and then pause. Sometimes I only shoot two. But it's usually three. See, there's two. There we go. There you go. One more hit. No big deal. There we go. Let's go, princess. Float your way. What the hell? I came back. No bonus. I was like, well, I missed the the uh, the jump, so might as well just stay with the princess. Her uh, floaty mechanic really uh, saves your ass.
And I was like, oh man, if I had Luigi. <laughs> I was like, get me up there, sniff it. It's like, nope. Oh, wait a second, that pillar. Pillar is higher than this guy. I'm not sure why I paused it there. Well, that was a waste. And I'm pretty sure I needed that ninja there. <laughs> no, I didn't. There's nothing up there. So, it's a waste of time and a waste of a... Uh, a diamond? A hit point? Look at that. Princess. You can make it. Come on. There you go. I hate this stage. I think, um... Uh, I think this is the only maze type. Oh. This is the only maze type stage where, um... You really gotta be careful. I was like, ah, uh, Fuck it. The checkpoint system, though, is uh, pretty lenient. See, if you die in this, in in this room, or um, yeah, this area here, it'll start you off at the bottom, and not all the way at the beginning. Timing, timing, timing! Ah. Oh. See, starts you right there. Very generous. I'm sure that's because, uh... It only gives you two continues. So the checkpoint system has got to be pretty lenient. There you go. There you go, princess. <laughs> oh, what was that? She just rocket... She just rocketed off that ledge. That wasn't me, that was her. Now this looked very suspicious. I was like, no. This ain't the way. And it looks like you get up there, but you can't. Or, uh, Princess can't. I was like, no. I remember something about that. Gotta go higher. Gotta go higher. And then these guys come back. It's like, I was like, what? What happened? I was like, no, I'm not going through that. But if I go back down there, these guys will reset. I'm pretty sure I would have died there, so... Might as well give this a try. It's got a duck. It's got a duck. Wait for a window. There you go. Get up there. Timing. It's all about timing. Timing! Timing! What are you doing? <laughs> Six lives. Man. I've gone through half of all my lives. If I hadn't gotten any, I would have uh, gone through both continues by now. And when you continue, it starts you off on stage one of whatever world you're on, so... It's a pretty big setback. Shit. Don't do that again. Come on, princess. Come on, princess! Get up there! <laughs> I think I'm getting nervous, getting flustered. It's like, fuck. I'm down to six lives. There we go. You don't have to float. You don't have to float every time. Come on. Come on. Come on! <laughs> oh no! Come on, get up there. Get up there! Get up there! Get... Uh. Timing! 
There you go. Boss time. Or is it? I was like, Kind of panicked there. I was like, no, they're not just... Yep. They're not just gonna let you go through. <laughs> Look at that. Cheap bastards. So you think it's over, but it's not. And now, uh, a boss has been... Oh, what was that? A boss has been, uh, demoted to simple key holder. Come on. The fact that you're on a conveyor doesn't help. I'm also scared that if I scroll it off, it'll reset its hit points, so I'm trying to keep it on screen. One more hit. Here we go. There we go. And of course, you can't climb with a key in your hands. <laughs> I hate that mask. The cool thing is you can use a key as a weapon. Unfortunately, you can't kill the mask with it, I think. I think only with a star power can you kill a mask. I was like, alright, so what's going on here? I was like, oh, I remember this. I remember this. So you think it's over, but it's not. <laughs> so random is this game. One more hit. Yep. Get in there. With style. And I was like, what? Wart? The last boss already? It was only the seventh world. Oh, jeez. I was like, alright. Alright. Well. <laughs> I'm not gonna complain. Let's get it done. Gotta be, ooh, gotta be careful, though. So his bubbles kill the vegetables and they kill you. So I was like, alright, alright, just gotta wait. There we go. <laughs> you gotta get Wart right when he opens his mouth. Otherwise the, the beets will, the vegetables will just go through him. He's like, alright, no problem, just gotta wait. I'm just gonna camp here, buddy. You keep spewing your bubbles, I'm just gonna wait. Until a uh, vegetable comes here, then I get uh, I get impatient. Damn it! Come on! I hit him. Did I hit him once? Oh, I'm I'm trying to figure out his timing. So I I figured it was like four seconds. I was like, no, that didn't work. <laughs> it's not four seconds. It's four seconds with a delay, so five seconds, there you go. I was trying to be cheesy there, trying to get him before, like that. And I got a little bit excited there, I was like, oh, did I get him already? <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. If I went for that, it, it would have killed me. Get nervous here. Here we go. Not yet. One more. One more. One more. One more now. <laughs> it's like, I got this. I got this. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, boy. And what is this? When... When did these... Bees? Come into play. 
fucking weird is this game? So I played Luigi five times, the princess three times, and Wart gets his ass kicked. Probably the strangest Mario game ever, including all the uh, spin-offs. It's just a dream. It's just a dream. I don't think uh, Dream Far <laughs> Dream Factory Heart Pounding Panic was a dream. I think that was the uh, legit. But they're like, how can we rationalize this in a Mario game? And they're like, ah, just make it a dream. <laughs> oh, Mario, Luigi, he's the man. He's the man in Super Mario Brothers 2. Princess 2. Toad's a little ninja. He's a little hard to use, though. The shy guy. Oh, it has the uh, characters here. Sniff it. The ninji, or ninjai. Bezo. Porcupo. Tweeter, Bobom. I think Bobom. This is the uh, first time he was got he got introduced. Panzer, Flurry, little shit. Alpatas. Subcon. What the hell are they? There's Pokey. <laughs> And Birdo, which we never saw. Oh, that's Birdo. Oh, okay. That's Birdo. Cobrat. Mauser, which we never saw. I think he was the boss of uh, World 2. Fry Guy. Clog. Clog Glip. Triclide. <laughs> and Wart. Whatever, dude. You don't get another game. The end. And about this time, I was like, where are the credits? There's no credits. I even looked through the manual. There are no credits in the manual. And uh, I started speculating that maybe because they pretty much stole this game and it's not a proper Mario game, they're like, uh, let's not put credits in there. <laughs> Anyway, 40 minutes to beat the game. Not bad. Uh, way better than Super Mario Brothers 1. And uh, I think the um, the world record is something like 9 minutes. Which is pretty crazy. But um, I think I did pretty well. Pretty, pretty good. And it was those bonus lives at the uh, first and second stage that did it. I got super lucky with those. If I hadn't gotten those, have you guys seen, you guys saw how many times I died. I think I ended up with just four lives at the end. So, pretty good. A shame about the commentary, but oh well. Uh, it's pretty quick, so hope you enjoyed that, and I'll see you in the next one. Mario.